If you've gone offshore this year for tuna or otherwise, you've probably caught some money, and I was dying to get in on the action. So I joined my friend Chris Landry of Rocksteady Charters for a trip out of Rockaway Inlet in New York City. But before we left, we needed to grab bait. Luckily, Chris's marina was loaded with peanut bunker, which we'd be using to bring the mahi off the pots a bit. When we reached our coordinates, Chris and I used his raised cobia station to spot mahi on lobster pots in the glassy conditions. This cut down on time spent casting around pots with little to no life on them. When we spotted a pot with mahi, we got to live chumming our peanut bunker to get them chewing. Although with all the life out there, sometimes the mahi were beaten to the baits. However, we soon figured out that the mahi preferred a vertical jigging action over our quickly cast and retrieved epoxy jigs. Once they started eating our jigs on the drop, it was game over. Oh my god, that was sick! Oh! Oh! Oh yeah, baby. The fishing brought some fast action, and while most of the mahi weren't larger than a few pounds, they were an absolute blast on our light seven-foot rods.